are at the Magic Kingdom. Crystal Palace officially reopened yesterday. It is no longer a character meal. Um, it's a family style instead of buffet, but they have some vegan options that we are excited yeah. to give a try. So that's what we're doing. <laughs> The other ones have like cheddar and bacon in them. They're just like itty bitty little guys, just little dudes. Um, and then you get a hot pepper jelly with it. We got a salad, but we don't think they gave us the vegan one because it definitely has blue cheese on it. Um, and the only difference between the two is one has blue cheese and one doesn't. So we're waiting for our server to come back so we can ask. All right, we got our vegan salad. They messed up. Um, so just know, not supposed to have cheese on it. It's got candied walnuts on it, and then you've got the watermelon and tomatoes in there, and it looks like arugula. It says crispy greens, but that just looks like arugula. <laughs> yeah. Get a slab. I got a slab of tomato. Got a slab of tomato. It's a weird salad. Yeah, right? It just says like marinated. It doesn't say like what it's marinated in. It just says marinated. It's a marinated and marinated. <laughs> marinated and then a marinade. The candied walnuts, right? Mm -hmm. <clears throat> That's good. The watermelon. Watermelon? I didn't really taste it. All I taste is the walnut and the tomato and the watermelon. Pretty bland. There's not really much going on with this salad. <laughs> if this was an option to like, choose from, like, what the set setup it is. Yep. Like, with that salad, like, I wouldn't get this salad. Okay, so we got our entree here. Um, it is the fried cauliflower. It comes with collards, potatoes, and then it's not on the menu, but I guess you get green beans. Looks like they're, mine looks super garlicky. Here's some, here's, I see a little bit of garlic. Yeah. Um, it comes with like a it's like a maple drizzle. Hot maple drizzle. Hot, hot maple drizzle. So I'm gonna try the cauliflower first, just because like the. But. Is it spicy hot or is it heat? I assume. I, <laughs> that's a good question. They boil the maple and then give it to you. It's hot. It's hot. All right. Cut, or it's cooked pretty well. At least it seemed like it. it's not like super um, soft. It didn't seem like super duper soft, but it also didn't seem like I was cutting into it like raw. Like, Al dente. Yeah. Good. This is just, like stupid good. It's definitely not like. I mean, they're a little like heat, but it's not like. Spicy. Like wow, that's spicy. Like I don't know, and then it's not like overly crispy, but it's got a crisp to it. I don't know how to. They did hold our food for five or so minutes because because they had brought us their own the salad, salad issue. Um, we can talk about that salad again real quick. The more we ate it, we liked the tomatoes and um, the arugula. And the arugula, watermelon didn't really add anything, and then the candied walnuts were just like too sweet. It just didn't I'll try a potato. That's a good sign. <laughs> We're off to a good start. A little, a little roasted sauce. Nice but So I took a, a bite of potato. <laughs> you can kind of see on mine the weird white. It's like kind of it was tough and gummy. I don't know. They're like cooked, but they're not. Yeah, almost like. They microwave them real quick or something. I don't know if I'm eating those. So. Alright, the collards. See how those guys are. They're really sweet. 
Ooh, I'm, I'm scared now. Not my favorite collards I've had. R.I.P. Tusker House, your collards. And you got green beans now. Some nice garlicky green beans. We'll see how they compare to um, Liberty Street Tavern. The only good side on this plate is green beans. Cauliflower and uh, Cauliflower green beans. Cauliflower is really good, yeah. Okay, this is very rare. Neither of us ate potatoes in a meal. The weird texture. I had a couple that were like soft, but most of them were that like They're I started weird, to... They're like... Obviously they look they were like sauteed. To like, yeah, to try to crisp them up. But then when you like... There's a weird like gumminess to them. And they're real like chewy. Yeah, they're not good. I don't know, they weren't. They were weird. Um, the collards were interesting because um, I ate most of mine. They were sweet, but they weren't. And we think it was there was a drizzle for the cauliflower. The hot maple drizzle. Yeah. I assume. So I th we think that got on the. On your it's like that's on your potato. So I think yeah. they kind of do it on the entire dish. Yeah. So we think that got on the collards, which bite, is what made it sweet. My first bite of collards were very sweet because I collards. They're cooked well, super tender. Yeah. No. I mean, really all good. the. This was good. I think this, you missed come from that. That was not. Prism. The only part of the cauliflower I had that was hard, I don't know if yours was, but the, the stock part of mine was like hard. Mine but everything else was super. Mine was okay. I had a, a lead. <laughs> See, mine was cut pretty, yeah. Yours. Cut per, or cooked perfectly. So. Yeah, delicious. Now we gotta wait for dessert. The only plant-based dessert option here is this strawberry shortcake. Um, we think this is a raspberry smoosh. Yours on the, the back of yours has like a whole bunch on the actual cake. Um, but it's just a basic strawberry shortcake. But he's, our server went to check and make sure the other things didn't have like gelatin or egg in them and of course they all do so this is it. I feel like it's more I mean, it's like a shortbread, but it's more like cornbread. <laughs> Just like the texture of it. It's really moist though, it's good. Clearly, we enjoyed these. $39 a person, which was pretty reasonable considering um, you had an appetizer, an entree, and dessert, and sodas included. Um, so it's really not that bad. I like that it wasn't character. Yeah. <laughs> um, when we first got there, it was like when it opened at 11.30, the restaurant was like empty by the time we were leaving, um, which I just took video of. It was full, uh, which was wild to see. wasn't expecting yeah. that at all. But food was super good. Would definitely definitely be going back there for that all of it yeah for sure the salad was other than the potatoes well hopefully the potatoes will be a little yeah, better next time salad was okay the salad was okay but everything else was great so yeah definitely would go I back. come back yeah so um, it's nice to see new options that are creative and just places reopening in general so yeah catch you later